even though 78 percent of our earth surface is covered by water then also we are facing water problem what is the basic reason behind this because only 0 0.01 percent of earth surface is covered by fresh water which is fit for our use and all the other remaining part of the water is our saline water which cannot be used that is the main reason we are facing the water problem today it is march 22nd where we are going to celebrate world water day why we are celebrating world water day the main reason for the celebration is how to conserve the water. What are the different methods to conserve the water? We being teachers, we can teach our students also why and how to conserve the water. Being a class teacher or a subject teacher, we can inculcate the habit in the students how to use the water judiciously. Judiciously means how to conserve the water and hmm, we can also tell the students the importance of conserving the water. First thing, we can tell the students that once they use the tap, they have to make sure that they have to close the tap properly and there is no leakage of water in droplets. How can we inculcate those habits in students by inculcating those habits in ourselves? This is the first thing and as it is a global problem there are some other methods also where we can conserve the water. How can we conserve the water and why this water problem has come we are going to say it right now. What is the humans usual? About 54% of reliable runoff. Or 54 that is more than 50% we are using in runoff. How it is? Power cooling 38% we are using. Agriculture we are using 38 industry 11 percent even in public pressure we are using 10 percent agriculture industry domestic power plants and then basically groundwater is the important one of the important source of water. How do this groundwater get replenished? But through rain? Through rain. rain. The major source of replenishing groundwater is the rain. But this nowadays, because of the human activities. Huh? With the water cycle? Yes. Water cycle. Yes, you are right. First thing, because of the human activities, because of the human activities like industrialization, urbanization, modernization, the groundwater is depleting day by day. The groundwater is getting depleting day by day. Mostly in cities, this groundwater or the water table due to the more construction of buildings, this groundwater is getting Depleted. The groundwater is getting depleted day by day. First and foremost thing we have to try to replenish this groundwater. How can we replenish this groundwater? Is there any way we can do? Deforestation. Afforestation. Wherever there is possible, we can plant more and more trees. Why we can uh, why we want to plant more and more trees? This is because the trees have been bringing trees in the water. Yes. First thing, roots bind the soil and absorb the water and by along with the soil, it binds the water loss. And it maintains the water table. Yes, it maintains the water table. And more and more trees, more and Loss of excess water.
water from the roots from the plants and this becomes water vapor and this water vapor helps in the formation of clouds